Hi, welcome to the Solutions Manual. In this video, we will solve the problem 5-43 from RC Developer Engineering Statics 12 edition. According to this problem, we have the uniform rod AB which has a weight of 50 LB. Determine the force in the cable when the tension is sorry when the rod is in the position shown. So to solve this problem, first of all we have to draw all the forces and the support reactions. So at point A I have a roller support which means that I have a vertical reaction generated here because of the contact of this roller and this plane. Let's call this AY. Since at point B I have a collar support which means I can slide this collar along the vertical direction but I cannot pull the scholar in the horizontal direction so a reaction is generated here like this let's call this NB also the collar is pin connected which means that the moment is allowed here so there will be no reaction for the moment we have been given the weight of the rod since the rod is uniform, which means that the weight will act in the middle of this rod. So let's say this is the middle of the rod and the weight will act here. Here is the weight. This is 15 LBs. Now we have drawn all the forces. Also, the string is continuous, which means that the tension throughout the string is same. So we have T here also. So our first equation for the equilibrium is sum of the forces in x direction equals to zero. I am considering right hand side as positive. So I have T cos 10 degrees the horizontal component of this tension t minus nb equals to 0 let's call this equation 1 i have to use another equation let's say some of the forces in y direction equals to 0 i'm considering upside as positive so i have a y minus 15 plus T sine 10 degrees, the vertical component of this tension force equals to 0. Let's call this equation 2. Now, we have involved three unknowns here, so we need one more equation. So, our third equation is sum of the moments about point A equals to 0. I am considering clockwise moment as positive. The reaction AY will not produce any moment about point A because it is passing through it, so there is no moment arm. The 15 LB weight is trying to rotate in clockwise direction, so it is taken as positive. Now for the moment arm, the moment arm is this distance. This horizontal distance. To find this horizontal distance, we need to consider this length. Now, this length is 2.5 feet because the rod is uniform, so its center of gravity will lie half to of the length. So, we have total length 5 feet and the rod is uniform. So, our center of gravity is at 2.5 feet. So, we have 2.5 cos 30 plus 10 degrees 40 degrees this is the moment arm for 15 lb force now tension t is also passing through point a so it will not produce any moment about this point the reaction nb is trying to rotate in counterclockwise direction so it is taken as negative now for the moment arm the moment arm for NB reaction is this vertical distance 
now this distance is pi sin 40 degrees we have nb pi sin 40 degrees equals to 0 and nb is trying to rotate in counterclockwise direction that's why it's, it is taken as negative so from here nb is equals to 8.938 lb if you put this value of nb into equation 1 because it would be a lot a lot easier to solve the tension t our objective because we have to find the force in the cable which means the tension so we have to use the equation 1 because it would be a lot easier for us to find the tension from the equation 1 so from equation 1 we have t equals 9.076 lb Let's write a statement here. Put NB equals to 8.938 in equation 1. This is the answer to this problem. I hope you will find this video helpful. If you do, please don't forget to subscribe to this channel and also turn on the bell icon for daily updates. And if you have any question about this problem, then you can ask it in the comment section and I will answer it as soon as possible. Thank you.